Hi guys, um, this is my first ever vlog. Um, I've always wanted to start my own vlog. Um, my name is Jordan Lynch Levy, by the way. Um, I'm a personal trainer at North Arsenal Centre in Dan. I've always wanted to start my own vlog. Um, I've been watching people since about 2014. Christian Guzman, Callum Von Moga, people like that, and they really inspired me, and I thought, well, why can't I do that? And I mean, they started from their bedrooms recording or do you know what I mean? Like Christian Christmas started when he was in university. So I thought there's no better time to start than when I'm young. I'm 21. Um, I'm from Lich of Garden City originally. Uh, I live in Kimpton now. I've been training for about three years. Um, don't worry, you'll get a physique update and stuff like that. <laughs> my first ever one done and stuff like that and a bit of my amateur posing and things of that nature. Yeah, I've, I've lived in Kimpton for about a year now. Um, I've been with my girlfriend for three years, Savannah Lane, and I've got a little boy named Bimari. He's 12 weeks old. So I thought, you know what, no better time to start like the present. Um, I've been passionate about fitness for about six years now. Worked in two gyms, worked in the one I'm in now for about a year. Really loving it, really getting on with my clients well, and I just wanted to branch out to other people and just share a bit of my knowledge and stuff like that. So, um, Hope you guys stick it out along for the ride. Um, I'm going to be recording a pool workout today. It's going to be the first workout I recorded to the camera, man. It's probably going to be terrible. It's with my friend Jeffrey. Jeffrey's probably going to do the camera in, so hopefully uh, he's a bit better than me. Um, and yeah, we're going to film pool workout, so I hope you guys enjoy it. Okay, so this is my uh, current physique at the minute. I mean, um, I wanted to start a cut as of the middle of April, but. Um, since I had a kid and I was getting quite a severe lack of sleep, I thought it was best to start a bit of a bulk. I um, wasn't really watching what I was eating, still training, uh, still doing bits and bobs here and there. Uh, just kept up to date really with my training, um, tried to do as much as I could, um, but really found it really diff increasingly difficult. As he got a little bit older, sleeping got worse. It's much better now, but at the start, terrible literally couldn't do anything so which is literally coming to work just about training wasn't really eating very well wasn't doing a lot of the rat stuff that you should be sleeping sleeping good keeping up to my supplement stack and stuff like that so it was di very difficult very difficult indeed but we're here now we're starting now started the vlogs started a good training pool session today see you soon hello guys so this is a raw training video of my pool session that I'd done the other day. This was last week now. So a pool session is back biceps and traps. So at the minute I'm doing a bit of a a bit of a weird bodybuilding training split right now. So I'm in a hypertrophy phase and hypertrophy means I'm trying to build muscle. So I've increased my protein intake, I've increased my carb, I've increased my fats, which are my macronutrients. But we'll go into that in a different video. So right now I'm talking about my pool session. So I started with a set of wide grip pull-ups. Now I love wide grip pull-ups they're such a good exercise because one they compound so they work more than one muscle group at the same time so they work my biceps and my lats um, which is good they're probably the, they're the two primary muscles working in that exercise now it's a body weight exercise as well so my body won't be so shocked going into the exercise so it's a nice way to warm up into into my workout definitely um, I then followed it up with a bit of inverted rows so inverted close grip rows so I started with and I've done four sets of those as well and the reason I do my inverted rows with my feet up is because uh, my gym is lacking in some equipment that I need to be able to build muscle. But what it does have is enough equipment for me to have a play around, make, uh, come up with new ideas and stuff like that. So I've, I've done an inverted row with my close grip to make sure I hit my rhomboids and my traps on the inside as well. So it's more of the centre of the back, the spine of the back, let's say. Um, I'll make sure I keep my core embraced, keep my back straight with all exercises and those are the things that you should always take into account and always do with each exercise. Um, I make sure that I do them nice and slow and controlled as well. You don't want to do the reps too quickly. You want to make sure they're eccentric and concentric and nice and slow and controlled. Um, the teaching points for all of the exercises, by the way, are on all the videos. Just pause them if you want to see. I've, always, I've picked three mains for each one, so you should be able to get enough out of that. Um, so with my push-pull leg split I was talking about, so the reason I've chosen it is because firstly I get to do something which is progressive, called progressive overload, so it's like a, uh, a, a different training technique where you increase your workload each session week on week. The reason it's good for progressive overload is because I do everything twice a week now, so I do push, which is chest, shoulders, triceps, 
I do pull, which is back biceps traps, and I do legs. So I do them all twice a week. Now I try to switch up the workouts every, every each time, twice a week, by targeting different areas each week. So for example, with my chest, shoulders, and triceps, I do my chest first one session a week, and then do my shoulders first second session a week because I want to switch up the dominance of each one. Whenever I do one of the muscle groups first, it'll be it'll be a, a large muscle group, and I'll always do that one. F the reason I choose to do it first is because I can go heavier that time. So I can go heavier because less of the muscles are fatigued, I have more energy, I've got more focus as well, so I can really ha smash out those, uh, that muscle group. When I choose that muscle group as well, I'm going to do three exercises that target that. Then I do two on my secondary, and then to finish off, for example, with buys or traps on back, or um, so on the push or on the pull day, I'm only going to do one exercise, but I'm going to do quite a few sets. So I've listed that on all here anyway. Um, yeah, so just enjoy the video, have a look through it, do you know what I mean? Just ha have a little look and see if you want to do the workout yourselves, guys. Um, let me know what you want to hear about on the next video or what kind of content you like me to cover, whether it's diet, whether it's training, whether it's what's going on with my diet and training in a minute, whether it's anything that can help you guys. Just comment subscribe like share stuff you know I mean? i'm going to put, put it on facebook and stuff so just have a look around i'm always going to be putting up training tips and stuff uh, follow me on instagram follow me on social media they're all leech levy fit underscore all my social medias anyway guys um, i hope you enjoyed the video and i'll see you next time